Today we're ranking our most interesting hiding spots from worst to best. And you're going to want to watch till the end because we're going to reveal a hiding spot that no one has ever seen. This was our worst hiding spot ever. The invisible shield. You know, I really thought this was a great idea, but the seeker was the undertaker. And this guy knows how to play hide and seek. Everyone go hide. Everyone go hide. Go, 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 go. go, go, go. I almost slipped. This is looking good. I like this. Are you sure you know where you're going? I'm 100% positive. Got my baby. I'm going in a tree. I just got to find the right one. You think I can fit in there? We have a secret hiding spot placed in the woods. I got the best tree right here. Okay, I guess I'm getting in here. All three of us ran in here. Who's finding us? This is an invisible base. If we duck under, you can't see us. Oh yeah, we good. We not good. <laughs> this is my hiding partner. Her name's Kaya. I know we're playing hide and seek, but who's gonna be the seeker? I have no idea. Don't you know it's my dad? The seeker's your dad? Mm -hmm. Wait, who's your what? dad? The Undertaker. The what? The, the Undertaker. Undertaker. It's time to find my daughter. Gabe? We're playing hide and seek with the Undertaker? Gabe, do you have a good hiding spot? Um. Yeah, it's pretty good. All right, good luck, bro. Why didn't you tell me your dad was the undertaker? <laughs> so yeah, that's what's going on today. I'm a little nervous. All right. Um, I don't think these guys really understand what happens when I find my daughter. That could turn out real bad for somebody. We're playing hide and seek with the undertaker. At least I picked a spot that'd be kind of hard for him to get to. He's a big dude. <laughs> 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 you hear that? Someone just screamed. Uh, oh, bro, that was sketchy. I think he fell out of a tree. I heard a branch snap. Oh, no. And uh, James told me he was hiding in a tree, so. Oh, boy. Whoa. I think I wrestled him once. Do you think if he finds me, he's going to body slam me? Maybe. There's possibility. 50 50. 50-50. I've made the decision. I'm going even deeper in the tube. This just fell off. Don't break the base. I did not. <laughs> there, I fixed it. It's very difficult to make this invisible base, so if everyone could leave a like on this video, that'd be greatly appreciated. Thank you. So I'm kind of bored, so I'm going to play a game playing that chase craft. As you guys can tell, we went full camo for this. Camo. With camo. Camo camo-ish, a little bit more camo. We got all the camo. I'm just gonna lay down, probably take a nap. Let me know if you see anything. Okay. <laughs> I could take a nap in here. When you're in here for hours, take a nap. Usually when we play hide and seek, it could take an hour, or it could take 18. I can't go any higher. I think this is a good enough spot. I'm probably like 20 feet up. I'm trying to figure out who that little girl was. Is she like a fan? I just sent Nathan an iPhone game for basketball. All right, so uh, me and Gabe are playing basketball right now. I don't know where Gabe is hiding. I have no idea. I think this guy needs an adjustment. What do you think is the best hiding spot? In a tree. In a tree. I know my daughter will climb a tree quick. Or somewhere really close to the ground. Well, we are very close to the ground right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> do um, checkers. Now we're gonna play checkers with Gabe. Yo, he wants to play checkers. I actually forgot how to play checkers. Keep hearing branches break. It might be the one I'm sitting on. I don't know, I might die. I don't know. Oh, I'm terrified right now. Uh, Y'all are making this a little more difficult than I thought, Mr. Nathan. So when I find you, I can't promise that you're gonna leave these woods, just so you know. It's a tricky game of checkers we're playing right here, as you can see. Sometimes you have to make sacrifice. Strategy, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, this is not gonna turn out well for y'all. Nathan, I'm coming for you, buddy. That's my dad, that's my dad boy. <gasps> I heard something. Oh, he's coming. This might have been a bad decision for you, my friend. This is the scariest thing I've ever done in my life. The fact that he can just pick me up and body slam me through that tree is so terrifying. Please buy tickets to my unspeakable live show before I get body slammed. Link in the description. Nathan. <laughs> no! <laughs> I've been found! You did find you anyone us? else? Y'all the first ones. No. We're the first ones! How did you see us? I think they found Nathan. 
Yo, why is this taking so long? This dude will get found or something? Of course. But you have to say, it would be a pretty good spot, right? It was a great spot, and I almost turned around because I said, ah, it's kind of outside the woods. I thought that invisible shield was going to keep us from getting tombstone pile drives, but we stood no chance against the Undertaker. Pine tree. Don't make me climb up there and get you. Ultimately, Gabe won by staying low to the ground. So you're not gonna beat me up? Not if you hurry up and get out of here. Pretty good spot though, huh? That's an awesome spot. Before we talk about our next hiding spot, we gotta talk about today's sponsor. And the sponsor of today's video is Rise of Kingdoms. Rise of Kingdoms is a multi-civilization strategy game, which is also cross-platform. In Rise of Kingdoms, you can choose from 14 historical civilizations that have truly existed. But you should be choosing Britain! I am! Rise of Kingdoms will also welcome the arrival of a new Greece civilization, featuring exclusive commanders and special units, Argaraspides. Britain! Just Britain! Excuse me. There is now a Civilization Clash event for players to fight for their own civilization. But you all need to choose Britain and join my team. Long live the queen! Oh, I mean the king! The king! The king! The king! You need to download Rise of Kingdoms right now by clicking the first link in the description. You can also use the promo code GREASE4ROK to get 20 silver keys. You can participate in the Civilization Clash event by clicking the second link in the description and fight for your civilization. You guys will have a chance to win awards like the new Apple Vision Pro, PlayStation 5, and the Nintendo Switch OLED edition. If Britain ranks as top, I will pick a lucky comment in the comment section below to win a brand new iPhone 14. I think it's super important for us to get back to hide and seek. Hey, who was that guy? I don't know. Invisible Shield was terrible, but we're getting a little bit better with our camouflage. We decided to travel to my theme park Boulder and invite some friends. We have seven hiders, and for every one I find, you guys are going to have to owe me a thousand dollars. When was that part of it? Oh, we got to pay you? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> There's only six of you. I think we're missing somebody. Oh, yeah. Britt's already in there. Someone's already hiding? Yeah, she's been making her spot for the last, like, three hours. That's not fair. <laughs> I didn't know we could do that. This is going to be the most insane amusement park hide and seek. All right, timer starts now. Oh, wait, how long do we have? Let's go. Let's go. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm gonna start looking. Good luck, boys! This place is massive. Look at this. I won the last hide and go seek I did with Unspeakable, so this should not bro, be a problem. Get out of my way, bro. I'm going, where are you going? Where are you going? I'm going up here. No, that's where I was going! So, I'm gonna be an employee. Oh my gosh, you're knocking everything over. Oh, dang. You sick, bro. Good luck finding me. All right, employee area right here. And what's really cool is Britt came here like three hours early to get painted to look like one of the rocks. There ain't no way he's finding the easy one. Calling it right now, I don't lose these challenges. We're winning this. Hey, yo, what are you doing out there? Yo, there's a whole cave in here. What is this? Should I go in here? I feel like it's too obvious. But what if I find one that's not like this? Doesn't have this. Best worker we've got. <laughs> I'm fully a Boulder employee now. Do I look in disguise? Look at this thing. It's like a water tower. I wonder if I can get up inside of this. Yo, I found me a screwdriver. Now I can actually get my way inside of this thing. I'm hiding under the uh, Basketball Connect 4 machine. There's a whole door that's gonna cover up this area, and that's the plan. Oh. This thing is like cracking. <laughs> it's so dirty up here, bro. I'm trying to get in a good spot right now. I'm in the machine, like. <laughs> I can literally watch somebody play the game. They look pretty safe to touch, right? I'm gonna make it look like I'm pressing buttons. I don't think I look suspicious at all. Yo, it's a whole entire mine shaft. Well, I got me a mask and I brought myself a gigantic flashlight. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going in. I don't think this thing was meant to hold this much weight. Please don't break on me. Oh, there's spiders. Yo, Nathan, take your time. I'm having a great time up here. Three, two, one. Lift off. I'm gonna find these people. Let the hiding begin. I see Nathan, so I'm gonna start doing employee tasks. Every person I find, I get $1,000. And the last person I find, I'm gonna give all the money to. I really hope I'm not the first one found because Topper took my spot and I feel like that spot was gonna be a banger. I don't really know where to begin. This rock looking kind of sus. Oh, yeah, there's no one in there. This looks like it needs to be cleaned up. I built this place. I would know where to hide. Drew spot is lit. I never even thought about that. I'm so scared that at any minute this thing's gonna break. I wonder where everyone else is hiding. Britt, like, why was she two hours early? And George, where did he go? I don't know where I'm at. 
Gabe probably got a good spot. And then, um, where's Nick? Nothing to see here. Oh, yeah. Chew poppy. Dang, they're good. If Nathan thinks this isn't hollow, I think there's no chance he's gonna find me. I'm so curious to know if he's past Brit yet. Have you guys ever seen a dancing rock before? You see, this is where it gets sneaky. This is all the storage parts of the park. This is usually where no one goes. Nathan just walked right past and didn't see me. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move locations and just fix doors all over the area. Oh, what is this? Jeez. Oh! Hey, who's in there? No one. Uh. <laughs> Yo, I found you. Why do you have a mask on? <sighs> it's very hard to breathe in there, man. This was like partly open, bro. Just give me the money. I... All right, on to the next. Bro, this thing's gonna break with me in it. Oh. Nathan's off to my left looking at an elevator. Maybe I need to fix that next. I have no idea if we've even started. I kind of zoned out on my phone and got comfortable on these pillows. There's a lot of arcade machines here to check. Can you hear Nathan? He's nearby. Luckily, you can't hear me because all, all these arcade games are so loud. Did you subscribe to the channel? Guys, you better subscribe. And one day, you'll come to Boulder and we'll play hide and seek. He just walked right past me. We're gonna move. I'm not about to have to pay Nathan $1,000. Yo, it's cracking. It's cracking. Okay, so I'm looking. I do not see anyone. There's no one up here. Okay, so clearly Nathan has not found me, and I don't think he will. So I'm gonna give him a little clue and take a photo and send it to him. Oh, oh wait, I do see someone. Do you see that right there? Yo, wait, bro, there is someone up here. Yo, yo, who is that? Yo, Topper? I'm looking right at you. <laughs> yeah, we found him. No shot. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I hear laughing. Take your money. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yes, Topper has been found. I told you that spot sucked. That spot was gonna be a banger. Can't believe Topper lost. Sorry, Topper, you should have been a rock. We're going into the kitchen right now. If there's one person that's hiding in the kitchen, it's probably Gabe. Has he found anybody? Yeah, no one in there. Thank you. Made it up. Ever since we opened the Boulder Park, you guys are always calling us, and we get some weird calls. We see today at 10. Today? Yeah, oh, they just call. We get like 10. Hello, I'm calling from Canada. The unspeakable make Boulder Adventure Park. Oh, this is a clickbait video. <laughs> was it a clickbait video? That's great. Right when he comes up here, I'm taking that baby down. There's someone up there. I don't know if it's an employee. Let's just go check. I can see somebody on top of the slide. Oh, it's just an employee. Oh, what's up, bro? Just working my shift. Bro, where are you going? Wait, where are you going? Nick just went down the slide. That was the craziest thing to see. I got you, bro. You got me. Where's my thousand bucks? It's in here. I just made it work in this shift. You the person over on that door? I was. You passed me there, this door. I was working this door. I was the employee working at all the spots. Four more people to find. I need to check behind more of these machines. Nothing. Is that game? What do you want? Leave me alone. Yo, that was a good spot, bro. Yes. Yo, where's my thousand bucks? Yeah, yeah, give me that, give me that. Another person down, that's three more. I think it's time to strap up, put on a harness, and see everything. Dude, as long as I'm not first, I'm a happy man. Now it's time for me to climb all the way up to the top. There has to be someone hiding up at the top. Anywhere on either side. Be sure to like and subscribe on this video. We're trying to get to 20 million subscribers. I swear I heard someone like over here. I feel like I can hear people talking, but I can't at the same time. I swear if we do all this work and we don't find a single person. I hear something, but it could be the workers. There's a cave in front of us, brother. Are you literally painted as a rock? It's just a rock. It's just a rock. <laughs> 
Unfortunately, I need a thousand dollars from you. That should be all of it. Thank you. I award you an invisible award that sits in my hand for definitely the best and most creative hiding spot. Uh -huh. So here you go. Yeah. Thank you, everybody. That rock camouflage was really good, but obviously not good enough. Next, we found Drew in a really good but risky spot. Uh, where's my thousand bucks? Who's yeah. that? James. James, I was second. And finally, James won by picking a clever spot that was just out of sight. Oh, nice throw. <laughs> For this next hiding spot, I'm pretty impressed because we were able to stump an entire team of cops. The police team has only 20 minutes to find us and we have five minutes to find our hiding spots. Let's go ahead and get into today's vlog and click that subscribe button because next time we're gonna play hide and seek on Mars. They're coming, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. What are we gonna I do? accidentally click the what unsubscribe do? button and the police are coming. They're no, gonna no. be here in five the minutes. The police are coming, James, the police. Stop staying in the stop, doorbell. Stop. That's not gonna help us. Here's the deal. We have a lot of police officers arriving in under five minutes. We need to find a hiding spot. I'm gonna hide in something nature-like. Yo, why don't we just leave? Well, I guess we're hiding. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, guys, so here's the deal. I look like a tree, so I'm gonna hide in a tree. If you guys could do me a favor, click that subscribe button right now. This is probably the craziest hide and seek video we've ever done, and there's definitely more to come. Ooh. All right, let's put the Can-Am right here. This is just a decoy. Ugh, my nutcracker. Now I need to get to my real hiding spot, which is back in the forest. We gotta hurry, guys. I only got a couple minutes, and I still gotta get all the way up in this tree. All right. How do I look? Do I blend in? Other than my head. I know, I have something for my head. Don't worry. Okay, so here's the goal. I'm gonna go climb all the way to the top of that tree. <laughs> Ready? Yep. Got it. All right, guys, I'm in my spot. I'm gonna set up all my stuff. I'm ready. <gasps> Oh, oh, oh. I want to get up there. Ah, take me up, take me up, take me to the roof. Go, 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 go. No time to waste, close this door. You gonna go up? Come on. Ah, here we go. We're moving. You know, this is pretty slow. Oh, there it goes, yeah! I think I see him. Go, 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 go. I can almost reach it. What's it look like up here? All right, I can hang out here all day. All right, guys, so I'm in my spot. I'm currently about 20 to 30 feet off the ground in the middle of a tree. And uh, I got this rope here that I'm going to use to tie myself to the tree so I don't fall out of the tree. All right, I'm just gonna tie this around my waist, my little harness. I'm gonna tie it around this branch here. Okay, feels pretty sturdy. I think we're good. Gosh, they have a dog. There's like eight people. Where am I gonna hide? Right here, maybe? Throw some pine needles over me? Yeah, this is the spot right here. This is the spot. Put the stuff right there. Gotta grab this tarp. I'll see you guys in the nether. Yeah, it smells like poo. Ah, throw pine needles on me. We're finally up here. So much room for activities. <laughs> oh yeah, don't wanna fall. Let's just go over here towards the middle and we're gonna hang out here. Perfect. I do have some utilities to use. I have some binoculars right here. I have my friend right here. This is uh, Willie the Nutcracker. And with Willie the Nutcracker, you of course have to have some nuts. There you go, Willie. Ooh. Hopefully, I don't drop Willie the Nutcracker because he is resting on a branch right now, just like me. This is so sketchy and so uncomfortable. I just wanna let you know. Okay, it's about time. I need to get my full uniform. That means the unspeakable hat has gotta go. Just gonna shove that somewhere back there. Now I gotta put on this. Woo -hoo -hoo. All right, we are good to go. I'm ready to hide. Hello, hello. What up, YouTube, YouTube? Yo, are you guys in your hiding spots? Unspeakable in, over. Willie the Nutcracker is getting kind of hungry. Charlie, Charlie, Delta, one, two, three, seven, six, A, B, C. This is unspeakable, over. Nine plus 10 equals 21, over. The police have decided to raid our island house, over. If I sit in this tree for another 20 minutes, I may have to poop out of the tree. 
Okay, so I'm up here. I have the best view ever. I have my little um, pack, which I haven't really gotten into yet. We have a super vibrant green jacket. Yeah, they could see that from a mile away, five miles away. What am I supposed to do with paint brushes? Colored face paint, tons of colors. We got blue, we got green, we got pink. We have a can of beans. There better be at least a can opener in here. Green paint, more paint. Is this gold? Oh, cinnamon. Not the flavor, the color. And then a battery for the camera. That's everything. Cool. Sounds like I'm gonna be painting pictures and trying to open a can of beans. Sounds like a good time. Roger, Delta. This is 123 Sugar Glider coming in. Hi. H how you doing, buddy? I'm doing fantastic. However, I gotta poop. Oh, that's a problem you got there, bud. Make sure to poop on the newest car. Roger, Delta Sugar Glider. Glider one, two, three. Unfortunately, there is no cars under me because I am in the middle of a forest. Whoa, 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 you can't get my call sign name thing wrong. It's Delta Sugar one, two, four. Delta Sugar one, two, four. I can see you from here. The hiding spot is trash. You know, I can see you from here too. Oh yeah. <laughs> what do I look like? You look like a human. Well, isn't that very specific Sugar Glider Delta one, two, A, B, C, three, four? Just call me Turtle. It's easy, you can't mess it up. All right, do we have James on the radio? James Radio. This is 96 Point James. Oh, yeah, I forgot. James is underground right now. So we got Gabe on top of the shed acting like Bob Ross on the toilet. We got Unspeakable in a tree acting like a squirrel. And we got James underground. He's unresponsive. All right, buddy, listen up. We're in this together. We're going to fight for our lives. We will not be found. We will never accept defeat. Oh. Do you hear that? They are here. The eagles have entered the nest. No, 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 that's just a fire truck passing by. Guys, there's literally cop sirens. I'm underground. And if you're seeing this, I hope you're subscribed. Oh my gosh, it's so loud. What up, Gabe? If you could finish up your painting pretty quickly, I think we're about to get arrested. No, I'm going to finish this, whether it's the last thing I do or not. All right, Gabe, I'm going to turn off my walkie-talkie for maximum um, silenceness. Uh, I will see you later. I'm literally underground for everyone right now. We are winning this hide-and-seek no matter what. I got this little bag right here. I'm start pulling stuff out of it. Let's see what I got. I got some ramen. Alpha team, I go this way. Bravo team, go ahead and go around that way. Yeah, I'm actually going to be mad if they find me and I'm not done with this. All right, that's that first horn. Let's make sure we check all these bushes really good. Check up in the trees too. I am a tree right now. You know, living the tree life isn't too bad. You really don't got to do anything. I do have some binoculars right here, but if I'm going to be honest with you guys, I don't want to use them. I don't want to make much movement in this tree. But why don't you go ahead and take point. House has been cleared. Let's go ahead and take the right. I don't even want to look. I just want to sit here and enjoy my painting. I don't want to know if they're about to get me. I don't want to know if they're right behind me. I just want to paint. Yeah, just make sure we get on the other side of this hill here. Lisa, the door's up on the shed up here. Check the autos. Let's go ahead and go around. You know, honestly here, it's really hard to tell. There are so many places. It's the trees, the bushes. Guys, I hear people. I hear people right now. We've already cleared the house, so we know they're not in there. You got these bridges, the buildings, so many different options. Lisa, if you want to take this hill. Ken, let's check out this shed. Coming in. Anybody in here? It's all clear. Oh, they're by the shed right next to me. Copy that. I'm going to go up this hill. Is that a dog? Oh my gosh. They have a dog. Why do they have a dog? I'm so going to get found. There's literally a dog. You ready? Yeah. There's no way a dog is not going to find me. It's probably going to climb the tree. Oh, they're in the shed right next to me. What was that noise? I can hear the shed opening. Apprehension team, if you're up there, come out. You're gonna get tased. Okay, I actually see them. And if I can see them, they can see me. So we're just gonna back up a little bit right now. How did they just get in there? Isn't that locked? If this dog does not find me, you guys have to click this subscribe button because I am the ultimate god at hide and seek.
Bubba, you want to take the right side? If you want to kind of go up the middle, I'll take the outside here. Ken, if you, if you want to stay on the fence line, Lisa, let's kind of fan out this way and we'll meet you at the warehouse. Make sure we check all these trees. Watch out for booby traps. I'm not gonna lie, I almost passed out. Go check this warehouse. Watch that brush, guys. Easy to hide. Because right now, I don't know where they're at. I hear someone walking in the leaves really close, so I'm gonna be quiet. Check it all, it's a perfect hiding spot. If there's anybody hiding in there, come out. Bro, are you kidding me? They didn't find me with the dog. They literally walked right under me. You've got to be kidding me. Bro, honestly, I've never sat that still in my life. Bro. They're going to see me from that angle, from behind me. I wouldn't move a foot. That's kind of scary. Like I said, I was there earlier. Uh, if you haven't hit that like or subscribe button yet, I put your friend for you guys. So much debris, and with all these pine needles and everything, super easy to bury yourself in this stuff and not be seen at all. Makes it super difficult to find them. Let's check this dumpster over here. I really wish I could eat this ramen right now. It's just looking at me. And I'm hungry. Unfortunately, I'm not wearing any unspeakable merchandise, so that's why I think I've been very well hidden. If I was wearing unspeakable merch, I would stick out like a sore thumb. I would look really good. Straight across, Bubba, straight across. You can usually tell when these pine needles have been moved if you really look closely, and a lot of the debris uh, definitely has a different look, so you can tell if someone's actually been in that area. There's a lot of other things, you know, even even things most people don't think about, you know, just, just simply watch, you know, the birds and stuff, you know, um, if they're getting scared in a certain area and so forth like that, that, you see birds flying or whatever the case may be, you know, it's just definitely a sign to, to watch for those things. I see a bug and it's coming towards me. It's on the handle right now. All right, let's get this warehouse. When we get in here, let's fan out a little bit, make sure we check everything. If there's anybody hiding in here, come out! No one's here. They're getting close. This is your only warning! No one's here. Come out! I'm already outside. You can't tell me to come out when I'm already outside. We're coming to get you! There's a ladder in there. If he grabs a ladder, I'm done. I think that's the 10 minute timer. That's the second horn. We're halfway there. That means they only have 10 minutes left to find me. And the odds of them coming back to a place that they already searched really well, very slim. Hey, Bubba just gave us a sign that he possibly seen one of our people on the, on the other side of the building here. I think they just found Gabe. Okay, that's our Bravo teams inside the building already. They're coming up. I would run, but I'm not gonna jump off a 30 foot tall roof. I gotta finish this painting. I have to finish. Bravo team should have came up this side and swept this area, but let's just double check it here. Well, good for me, that ladder is really weird to work in. It takes a little bit of time to actually get it extended. So hopefully that slows them down enough. All right, we need to get out behind the shed. All right, let's move out. I don't think they're gonna find me. I really don't think they're gonna find me. And honestly, Gabe and James are in really good spots too. I think we might be able to win this. Oh, I hear the dog, I hear the dog. They're getting close. They must be struggling with that ladder. I might not make it. I hear them, they're nearby. A bird just landed two branches above me. They're doing a good job. A bird flew away. Come 
out. Come out now. Never. Get out. No. Come on. You will never take me Let me, me see your alive. hands. I think they found someone. Okay, they found James. I think they found James. Sounds like Bravo team found somebody. Come on. There's a dog out there. Let's go. No, dog's not here. Get out now. Okay, I'm coming out. They have definitely found James. And he's really close to me, so maybe that's going to give me enough time to make it. Maybe they won't find me. Poor James. Should have uh, hidden a tree, bro. It was almost there. <laughs> I think James is trying to run. I don't know if that would be the best idea, considering they do have weapons. I would have got a win with it if it wasn't you meddling kids. All right, roll over on the shoulder. Bring your legs up. That was so close. What gave it away? Is that a uh, bright green hat? <laughs> oh, was it sticking out? <laughs> got one. I didn't do it. <laughs> Hell, whatever. Just wait. You'll never find my buddies. What do you think? I think it's fantastic. There's a bird that just landed right in front of me. I would try and grab the camera and turn it, but uh, there is people nearby. There's two other criminals. He's got to be one up in a tree. And I'm still thinking there's one buried somewhere. We only have a couple more minutes left, and we should be able to win this game. Did you guys check the tree line? We walked the whole thing. Did you guys walk the entire tree line on the other side? There's something over here. They just said someone is in a tree. That's me. I am in the tree. They either saw me, or they just found Nathan. I'm going to scoot down a little bit so my head's not peeking over the, uh, the highest part of the um, roof here. They're going to start looking in trees. They're going to start looking up. This is not good, guys. This is not good. I can hear them. They're about 50 yards out. I'm going to go into silent mode and not moving mode. Let's a couple of you come over here and let's re-sweep this over here. Let's just fan out and check it again. Oh. Is that five minutes? Yeah. They're nearby away from me. They are very, very close. I'm trying my best to not move a muscle. I can feel the tree moving with the wind. I am one with the tree. I am tree man. There's a bunch of brush right up under here. Right there. Get out of the tree now! Get out of the tree! I see you up there. Come on! Oh no. You're under arrest, buddy. Get down. Found me. Come on down. <laughs> <laughs> no, they found me, boys. No. Jump or yeah. fall, come on. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> easy now, easy now. I am exiting the tree. All right, hands behind your back. To no. the house. I've been found. Can't wait to grab that bag. <sighs> Probably. I thought I was going to make it. There's Not only today. a couple seconds left. I thought the ghillie suit was really creative because camouflage tends to work, but Gabe won just by being on the roof of the barn. Uh, when I'm done with my painting. 10 out of 10. Best painting. While James lost hiding underground, they had to really look up to me and Gabe. Literally up. Is this the first time Gabe has ever won? This might be. What about the haunted house? You're the last one! Oh! I guess it's not about how you look, but more so where you hide. Oh, uh, hey! <laughs> Congratulations, you have won the video. I won? You won. I won a hide and seek. We both like got found. My third time ever. You are victorious. Awesome. We're almost to our first place hiding spot, but first, this is our second best hiding spot ever. Okay, let's go ahead and make it to the top of the slide. I gotta hurry. What if I was in? No, cannot get an ice cream. Every person that gets found, they're getting punished. You're gonna have to do that slide blindfolded. You have to clean up goat poop. Uh, let's go blindfolded in the maze and then free fall 50 feet out of the air. Hi guys, I'm hiding in the white guys. I see a spider in here already. I hate spiders. So now I need to get into my hiding spot and I'm actually gonna stay in the middle of the slide while the water is running. I got these grippy shoes to help me. Oh, this is great. This is great. Right here. I can the camera around the corner just a little bit. See if he's close. Oh yeah, this is easy. I'm hiding good. I could hide with the snakes. There's Topper. Where is he going? Okay, this is definitely my spot right here. Let's go ahead and jump down here. Oh. Yo, I'm literally walking down a water slide right now. Oh, this is so sketch. Oh, okay, so I've made it to the enclosed part. All I need to do is stay in the slide. I think James is coming though. I just gotta stay here because I could hide in here behind there. Oh yeah, he won't find me. Ooh, we got some glasses. Hi. Mm. 
Jumper. So far, so good. I don't think anyone's come near me. So I'm currently just hanging out on this corner spot. A lot of the water goes up on the wall, so I have a standing spot right here. Oh man, I didn't even check all these lawn chairs out here. You got too much dip on your chip, kid. Yeah, I don't see anyone under those bad boys. All right, time for an update. Let's see. Clear so far. I feel like my spot is good, but James is pretty smart. Just to let you guys know, I am prepared to literally stay back here for a week if I have to. I'm not losing this challenge, and you guys can flash back to this clip because this is just the beginning of the challenge, and I promise I'm not going to lose this. I've been sitting here a good while, and uh, I have no idea where he's at. I'm going to take a peek. I don't see a single person. This is going to be a long game. This way. So I do see James. He looks so lost and confused. I don't even think he's found anyone yet. Go check these two. Right. I don't think no one's over here. I just saw James, I think. I saw someone. I literally haven't seen anybody. I keep looking around, there's nobody coming. I'm getting a little bored. So let's walk up the stairs. Let's see what it's like up here. Pretty nice. I might just hide right here. It's a better view. It's kind of nice up here. Wait, I think I hear something. <sighs> it's just a bug again. I'm gonna be here forever. <laughs> I found you. That would have been a great hiding spot under there. The thing is, is if James wants to find me, he's literally gonna have to grab a team and go down this exact slide. There's other slides at the top of this tower that he can choose to go down. He can't see me. I'm enclosed in here. This is such a cheeky spot. So, all right, I'm on the move now. I'm starting to walk around. I still don't know where anybody is. All right, come on, here we go. I see Topper. I think they just saw me. I think they're pointing at me. Come here, Topper! Yeah. Oh god, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, he found me, he found me. Oh, I hear someone screaming kind of nearby. Did someone get found? Are they being chased? Oh my god. Come on, no, 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 no. James is coming, James is coming. I just saw Topper. Topper just ran. You can't outrun my eagle eyes. I spot you from miles away. We're gonna reserve our energy until the chase begins. Oh my gosh, he's literally looking for me, looking side to side. James, you're a loser. You can take the L. He's walking towards me. I'm really fast, so he's not gonna catch me, but he's probably gonna find me. Here we go, I'm about to have to run. What up, pretty boy? Oh! Oh! He's running after I outran him. He's turning around. That is how you outrun. James. All right, guys. I've been in this slide for almost an hour. I have no sight of James. I have no idea where he is. I have no idea if he's even found anyone yet. I haven't seen him walk up to the tower yet. It's getting kind of boring in here. I'm not going to lie. All right, guys, I'm out of breath. I outran James. I'm going to the top of the slide now. So, James is literally not very far away. Let's see if he comes over here. I hope he doesn't. Oh, I've been in this spot for at least an hour. My back is on fire. <laughs> oh, okay, yeah, you got me. You got me. Okay, wait, am I the last? I won, right? James, I won. Let's be honest, I won. You won in our viewers' eyes. Wait, I'm not the last? We've been doing for like three hours. No! No, you got Topper! It depends if we're playing by Topper's rules or unspeakable rules, because if so, Topper's first and then you're second. Yeah, Topper's first. He got caught. This is our second finder so far. <laughs> yeah! Good. He's probably really we'll sad. Just, we'll He's probably let, crying. We'll just let Topper keep hiding because- Oh, he's still hiding? Yeah, like he ran away, he kept running. Okay, well, that counts. He was first. He lost. So there you go. Proof. It's from the girlfriend. Have fun with the gators. I gotta go find other people. I'm actually with the gators? Mm -hmm. All right, throw me with the gators. Here we go. Hi, guys. Ah, ah, you're moving. Oh my God, that much tape is lost. This tape came off. Hi, you look so nice. Yeah, I'm a gator handler. I like this punishment. All right, how about the big boy? He's scared, he doesn't like me. Hi. Ah, you my friend? Yeah, it be like that sometimes. Look at those teeth. That could have bit me. The tape came off and this one could have bit me. No one would have known. I really feel like we should uh, register for hide and seek world championships. I 
just saw James. I'm grabbing this raft. Super sneaky. Hey, James! Am I the last one? Stopper is am in I denial right now. He's right there. Am I the last one? No. Who's left? Three more people. Three others? I found two people so far. That's it. Who did you find? You and Coley. You didn't find me yet? Young kids in denial nowadays. Can't accept the people. When I wake up, the downside to this spot is if they do find me, I can't run because my feet are asleep. My feet are numb. There's James right there, I see him. He's on top of the kitty section. I don't know if he just saw me. I hope he didn't see me. Wait, unless they're in the life jackets. Hi. Did you look at the slides or no? They wouldn't hide there. So like, my thing is, Hopper is automatically getting the- Oh yeah. He's, automatically. Yeah. I'll let him have the privilege of getting tagged, but he's automatically With getting that. Well, there goes Cedric right there. Not the brightest child to run away. Might as well go after him, huh? <laughs> Just so it's like it's just me and him so far. Yo, I honestly think Cedric was hiding right here. Yeah, he was in here. <laughs> what a crazy view up here. I have been on this slide for so long right now. I need some food. Like, honestly, I'm starving. I don't think they hurt. He could be the last one. It's all good. I thought Cedric's book is this way, though. I'm down far. I'm Cedric. Honestly, we were going to the inflatables, and then I turned around, and I saw you just running. Yeah, I saw Topper run that way. Yeah, I found them first, but he wants to play tag. And that's not how Unspeakable does it. All right, so it looks like my punishment is to walk through this maze blindfolded and I can't see a thing. I'm scared I'm gonna hit a wall and just like knock myself out. And what sucks, okay, here's a corner. What sucks is no one's here with me. <laughs> I probably look like such an idiot. So I'm gonna send a decoy raft down and see what slide he's on. Oh, he's grabbing a tube. I think he's putting the tube in the other slide. I'm gonna go down this one. Oh no, oh no. He's putting the tube on this slide. Oh no, 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 no. Holy boy, it's cold. The water is a little nippy today. Oh. I think he's coming down this slide. Bro, what do I, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? <laughs> bro, I was like, oh, he's definitely in the other one. Last minute, bro, just bring <laughs> I'm so sad James found me. And now for our very best hiding spot that actually never happened. Let me explain. You probably remember our secret gaming base video from a few weeks ago. We hid from the cops in really creative spots and mine was under a bridge. And it turned out to be a pretty awesome spot and I even won the hide and seek. Am I the last one? Yes, you're the last one. Oh, does that mean I win? Uh, we win. Oh. Or at least I was the last one found. But what you guys don't know is that the bridge base was actually supposed to be underwater. This is our first base. When it came to sinking the underwater base, it just was not working. This is an update on our underwater base. This is the base right here and we're currently trying to sink it. However, we ran into a pretty big issue. It's not gonna work. We have used over 8,000 pounds of concrete to weigh down the base and try to sink it. And still more than half of it is above the water. I think the main issue is, is the base itself is too big, which means we have to go back to the drawing board and the last, two weeks of progress are completely lost back to square one. Over the next couple weeks, our team worked on a new design, which was much smaller, but had a lot more weight to it. So we thought it could get underwater. But when the day came, it just still would not work. Unfortunately, this base never happened. We spent so much money researching these bases and almost two months building them. But I'm still proud of how the video came out. Maybe someday I'll put a gaming base underwater.